Structural steel is fireproof to last between one and two hours, which it did, and then steel melts. It began to melt the steel. That steel literally melted, and down they came. Literally melted the steel. Steel in those buildings is uh, designed to accept uh, 800 degrees temperature, melts at 1,500 degrees, and the jet fuel fire produced 2,000 degrees. As the steel began to soften and melt, the interior core columns began to give. It all pancaked. Melted beams where it was molten steel. Bright, bright reddish orange color. Red hot. Like the fires of hell. Heat literally melted them together. Molten steel running down the channel rails. Like you're in a foundry. Mm -hmm. yeah. Molten metal dripped on the sides of a wall. Let us never tolerate outrageous conspiracy theories concerning the attacks of September the 11th. Malicious lies that attempt to shift the blame away from the terrorists themselves. Nobody, no eyewitness who said so, nobody who's produced it. 